Hello everybody, my name is Python, and welcome back to the 11th episode of the Terraria Co-Class playthrough. How are you doing, Mr. Dr. Chippy? I am, I am good, my good friend. I was waiting, <laughs> I was kind of waiting for you to add a few more titles. Dr. Chippy, Reginald, Sergeant. I like it because the guys in the comments keep calling me Dr. Chippy. <laughs> <laughs> it's brilliant. I've just realised you're not on the team again. What is going on? Oh my god, I'm the worst with this. I'm on green. Alright, on to green. Yeah, buddy. But uh, yeah, in today's episode, we, we actually kind of forgot to take down one of the most basic bosses in order to get ourselves a witch doctor because, well, what's the plan? We're planning to get some wings, right? Yeah, so we, we need the leaf wings, and obviously to get that you need a witch doctor. You need to move them into the jungle, and then it's like a platinum. Um, but then it's it's obviously important, because when we do the destroyer, you need the mobility. I personally always choose this method of wings. All well about the it. wings. So, uh, yeah, we need to take down Queen Bee, and this should be well, quite possibly the easiest fight going in the entire world. So, <laughs> probably don't even need don't to set up an arena. Mode. <laughs> This is probably going to be harder than when we uh, took down the uh, Skeletron Prime on the uh, One Weapon Challenge. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, man, I'll feel you. Oh, no, this guy's getting destroyed, man. Oh, my God. And this weapon is doing its job. Jesus. <laughs> this is, oh, wow. Get freaking oh. wrecked. Wait, where's oh, yeah, the big, bag? Big bag? Oh, treasure bag up here. It's like against oh. the wall. Yeah. Bam. I got... Ooh. Dun, 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 oh dun, no dun. way! That's yeah, incredible. I, I think it's a 0.001% drop. That's one incredible. Of the one of the, it, when damaged. Due to recent changes, it's one of the rarest items in the game. That is incredible. I can't believe you got that, man. I'm really happy for you. I also got a, a beekeeper, which is kind of nice. Ooh, and hive uh, one, bee nades, bee wax. Just a bunch of crap, bee really. Bee nades. All right, well, anyway, we should get a witch doctor now. Now, do we have everything ready for the destroyer? Uh, yes, we do. You reckon we could take him down? I think we could take him down. I, I imagine we'll need our wings first, but I think we'd do just fine, to be honest. Yeah, if not, we'll just farm out and get some more stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and TP back real quick. And uh, let's uh, make our way over to the arena. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. I'm a one tier arena. We should probably put a campfire down real quick. There we go. And I'll get another oh, that's one. That's a good going. point. Maybe like a little heart lantern or something. Uh, I don't have any of them, unfortunately. Uh, let me go see if there's any in the valuables chest. Shouldn't be that difficult to do. Uh, no. We are waiting till we get wings, though, right? We 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 can yeah we can try wings. Because uh, I imagine because we're in expert mode, it might be a little bit too hard without the wings. Yeah, you think? Oh, yeah, definitely. But then again, we do have the uh, Shield of Cthulhu, you know, and that does help a lot. It does. I should probably get that back on, actually. That'd be really, really good to avoid them. Uh, right, let me put some heart lanterns down. And I'm just making a little uh, beekeeper station. Ooh, that's a nice idea. I like that. Sweet. Yeah, they're, they're really good. I like them. That's a Do really you ever make idea. these in your series? I the only time I've ever made it is in like my expert series. Oh crap! I just quick stacked all of my patients away. Ah, <laughs> ah, that's the worst. I hate when that happens. Oh jeez. Oh, I just drunk one by accident as well. You see, I'm, I'm all about that. making these little healing stations because I'm not very good at like doing boss fights. So you'll see in some of my series, I actually do a lot of this. I feel these you. These heart statues a lot as well. Yeah, heart statues are amazing. Uh, yeah, if you're lucky to get them. I think like it's like such a rare chance of getting them. You get like three or four a world, but if you get them, they're really, really good. Yeah, uh, right. We don't need bee wax, don't need bee nades, or bee pants, or a hive wand. Unless we want to make something out of hives. I don't think so, really. No. Hive pack right. increases strength of friendly bees. That bee station is now completely done, by the way. Hey, bee station. Love it. Nice. You can run through it quite nicely as well. Ooh. Ooh. Hold on a minute, can I combine these two? I feel like I can. The Lucky Star Cloak and the, and the Honeycomb. Uh... Oh yeah, you can do something. Oh, I can! Bee Cloak! Causes stars to fall bee and cloak. releases bees. That's really cool, actually. So this is like an ultimate defensive accessory. It's really cool. Check it out. Can I see it? Have a look. Never... Oh wow, Joe, I've never ever seen this. When did they add it? I, I would assume 1.3. I actually don't have any idea. <laughs> oh my god, it... Oh my god, I never even knew that was a thing. Yeah, man. And that combined with my hive pack increases strength of friendly bees. I don't know how it's going to do, but I'm feeling like it might do decent. 
what what weapon are you going to use? Uh, I'm thinking maybe a combination of the Demon Scythe and the Crystal Storm. I'd, yeah, no, definitely. 100%. Yeah, man. Okay, so we need to go ahead and try and find ourselves up some wings, perhaps. Unfortunately, I don't think we're going to get the fight done in this night, so it should give us a decent amount of time to get some sort of wings going, right? Yeah, because we could we could go for a, a different style of wings. I mean, there is a, a floating island over here. Yeah, that's right. And I should also... Where's the blocks chest? I should really think about making another house. So I'm going to get some stone and some walls. Ooh. Ooh, nice one, nice one. <laughs> that is beautiful. There you go. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, I think I'm going to go and make myself a house in the jungle. And in the meantime, maybe you can farm out for some sort of wing thing. All right. Okay. Quick little jump cut. Bloody blood moon. Expert mode, man. Man. Now, what we need is one of those enchanted sundials. Yeah, they're good. I like them. Get them from uh, fishing crates. I think iron yeah. crates. I think in you can mode. get them from wood crates, but they like. You get them from fishing crates in hard mode. Yeah. Uh, you can get them a random chance from any crate. Huh. Yeah, not bad. Ooh, a money trough! Hey, man! I got a money trough, and I got it on camera. I'm feeling good about it. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, check it out, guys. I did not know that this was here. It wasn't until Chippy said just now. But yeah, there's a there's an underground house in the freaking ocean. What is up with this? Oh, you've honestly never <laughs> seen this before. <laughs> this is amazing, though. I've never it had seen a coin this. portal inside of it as well that I just robbed. <laughs> oh, for real? Yeah. That's amazing. I've just got an extractinator. That's kind of like it's an, your own little ocean farm. Do you know what yeah, I mean? It is. It is. You can you kind can just of drill in there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I got a pirate map. Oh, oh snap! Wait. Yeah. Uh, you don't get awesome. any magic weapons from it, though, do you? No, I think you asked me this in the last episode. I think you can get summoner weapons and a melee weapon. Ah, so I think it'd be a good left to do, though. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, in the meantime, we're still farming out. We're trying to get the witch doctor to move inside of his house. We had a blood moon previously, and he, well, he died, which is fun. Yeah, he got slaughtered pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, yeah, we're pretty much waiting for night time so we can roam inside this house. We can get ourselves some wings and then uh, take down the, that destroyer because we've been waiting for days in Terraria now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, it is night time. We have the witch doctor here and we should be able to buy ourselves the wings. Yes. Ha -ha! Bam, got him. Oh, baby, I'm feeling good about it. So we had the Aries getting cold all around you message. So I'm feeling like we need to move away. Perhaps go back home, in fact. Maybe go to the arena. Yeah, I say we go to the arena. Yeah, I so yeah, like basically a, a, uh, a Skeletron Prime is going to spawn now. We don't actually know if we're going to be able to beat it or not. I'm, I'm going to say probably not, but then, then I'm going to go with know. probably not. But I kind of want to try it at the same time. Oh, yeah, I'll definitely give it a go, man. Definitely give it a go. So let's right, go I just and, need uh... to grab a few potions. I'm going to grab a Night Owl, an Iron Skin. I've got a Regen on me. I'll go for a Swiftness. Uh, obviously, a Hunter. Oh, I've got so many buffs on me. Well fed, magic power, heart reach, endurance, mana regen, regen, night owl, swiftness, iron skin, heart lamp, campfire. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't uh, got an archery. I should have made an archery. Here he comes. All right, okay. All right, I'm going to buff up. All right, I think he's targeting me first. Oh, That's okay. Oh, let's try and get out of the house. There we go. All right, okay. So there this is honestly completely different to the one that we did in our... Uh, uh, one weapon challenge. I mean, this guy is a beast, isn't he? He is an absolute beast. Oh, He's going to destroy just, us, man. Do you think? Let me just get some uh, regen from the honey. The only time I can realistically do damage to him is if, well, when he's doing this, when he's spinning around. That's also yeah, when he I've does tried the most to damage. Do it, I've tried to do it with the crystal storm and failed in the past. It's quite Have difficult. you got any arrows on you? I do not. All right, okay. I'm going to need arrows. <laughs> Huh. Well, this is an interesting idea to try it at least. Oh yeah, definitely try it. Uh, flower I mean, flower? I'm not. I'm doing fine for health. Like, I'm doing completely fine. Make sure you step in that honey pool at the bottom, buddy. Get yes. Some extra regen. Definitely. I'll it's 30 seconds worth, so. Serious regen. Sure keep getting in that. Um, while he's targeted me, do you want to try and buy? Can you buy me some arrows real quick? I can certainly attempt to. Uh... Right. Yeah, he's still locked on me, so I'm just gonna move him to the side a bit. All right, buddy. If we have a merchant. Merchant. Merchant, stop. Stop moving. All right, come on, man. All right. Uh, final full stack. 
Oh, right, full stack obtained. Running yeah, full over. Stack I've just chucked it down beside the campfire on the right hand side. Okay. Thank you. Oh, that's the point. Why am I not using my Nimbus rod? I'm a complete idiot. Oh my god. Oh yeah, good point. Get some extra damage in there. Yeah, man. What is up with me? Right, he's moved on to you, so make sure you get some honey. Shall do. Alright, he's down to 44k. This is more of an endurance fight than anything, let's be honest. Yeah, like looking at it now, it just seems like an endurance fight, to be honest. He is down a quarter health, though, pretty much now. Which is pretty nice. Yeah, this is the thing. Do you think we're going to do enough damage to actually get him done by the end of the night? Because these attacks are not going to get stronger, are they? They're, I mean, if anything, no, he's going to lose hands soon, so. Well, not soon, but soon, soon. This is like one of the only bosses that wasn't actually buffed in expert mode, right? Yeah, no, it's pretty much the same. I think it's just got a little bit more health. Yeah, just the health. And I think its head does a little bit more damage. Oh, when he's spiky, oh, yeah, right, definitely. Please. Yeah, oh, make sure you heal. Grab a heal and uh, grab some honey. There we go. He's nearly at half health. Oh, mine out the bombs when he shoots him out of his cannon. Okay. All right, he's, uh, one of his hands is going to get pretty low. Oh. Um, all right, he's definitely targeting you now, mate. All right, here we go. Oh, his vice is coming over. Oh, oh it may as well, may as well grab it. I'm going to target his hand for a second. You know, the low one. All right, we got him, man. Okay, so we have five minutes left on this fight, so I think we're going to be fine. I think we could potentially do it. It's going to be quite the interesting first fight. I have never taken down Skeletron first first. No, me neither. It's actually, yeah, it's a new thing to me, this. Completely no, yeah, yeah. Right, we fresh in the clouds. All right, here we go, here we go. Kick his ass. If okay. we can get rid of his arms, then we're good, man. We could take him down. Yeah, I mean, like, look at it. Like, his arms are going to break. I think that's what's going to speed up the fight. Just because we've only got five minutes left. I think that's what's going to do it. Come on. We've only got about two minutes left on our potions, though. All right. bring any extras, because I didn't think about it. Oh, God. Right, look at that. I mean, two of them are really low. Two of them are really low, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, come on, man. We are really giving this a decent stab, which is really cool. Yeah, I think because there's two of us, he's a lot more easier to maneuver, I think. Yeah. All right. We've got about four minutes left. Okay. I feel like we should have this. Oh, another one of his arms are gone? Yeah. Oh, no. I need to... Oh, I need to get out of there because I ain't got my obsidian shield on. I swapped it out for the uh, wings. Ah. Oh, okay. I need to heal up. Oh, don't die, please. Okay, nah, I'm fine, I'm fine. I, I just can't need to get handle better that better. pressure. <laughs> <laughs> it's usually you that dies, and I have, to, I have to wing it for a little while. You're quite right, it is usually me. Oh, oh another right, arm almost down. Right, almost dead. If we keep him on this level, then it might be a lot easier. Ooh, okay. Alright, I'm just going for his vice at the minute. Yeah, I keep having the first J. Oh, there he is. Let's get, 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 get him. Okay. 14k? Three minutes left. At this rate, we should just do it. Yeah, we've got three minutes left, so. Okay. Come on, man. Putting down a cloud. It's just broken 10k. His arm's almost completely dead. And Jay. Oh, come on, arms. It's so nearly done. How was how, how that sword blade? Oh, there you go. All right, All right one, one more. We got this, man. I'm, I'm feeling it right now, dude. We've only got two minutes and a half, though. But I think we should be fine. Just to get rid of that bloody little claw thing. Once you get rid of that, he's... Easy. All right, okay. 5k! Are you dead? No, you're fine. Oh, my <laughs> God, dude! Told, did you ask if you're dead? Oh! Dude, we're so nearly... Ha We've got this... I can't believe it. The first tech boss we're going to take down. It. Look at that. Get that. Get that piece of mana there on the on the right. And he's done. Oh my god! <laughs> I did not <laughs> expect to do that. Oh, no. he gave it a proper good go. Oh, I'm so proud. <laughs> I'm so happy with that, man. An expert I... mode Skeletron Prime. First, first go, go, and also the first mech boss we take down. That's Damn. incredible. Oh, there you go. man. Super happy about that. I really am. I really am happy about that, man. All right. So, oh, wow. 
I can't believe it. I'm, I'm actually quite I'm actually, disbelief. yeah, like flabbergasted. Do you know what I mean? I know, right? All right, and in three, two, one, poof. What did I get? No, nothing interesting, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, either. I just got one of the pieces of the um, the mechanical wagon. I got 33 hallowed bars and 32 salt of fright. Hey, oh, I got a whole bunch of money from that. I got 41 gold coins again now. Oh, snap. That's nice. Oh, right, oh man. Oh, my God. I'm honestly so shocked by that. I'm like, whoa. I'm kind of <laughs> taken back. I know, I'm really, really quite chuffed to bits with that fight and how it went. So, uh, yeah, I think on that note, next episode, we're hopefully going to take down another mech boss, hopefully. Yeah, well, I imagine we could probably take down two next episodes. I mean, we've got... Well, we have two summons for the mechanical worm at the minute, so... Ooh, that's kind of nice. Mm. All right. So, anyways, guys, on that note, it is time to end the episode. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy the video, do be sure to drop a like right in. And, of course, hit that subscribe button if you don't want to miss out on future content. On screen for you guys is the next episode of the Terraria 1 Weapon Challenge over on Chibi's channel. And, uh, yeah, I'm just about wrap it up. Thank you so much for watching. We appreciate your continued support. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.